It is a beautiful, beautiful day on the Oregon coast today. We've come out to explore some of the Samuel H. Boardman State Scenic Corridor, which is a mouthful to say. There's a lot here that we haven't seen. Uh, specifically, we've come to find Secret Beach. This is an unmarked, unofficial beach that can only be found at low tide. I think there's three beaches. One beach can be accessed even if the tide is high. It's not gonna be a super low tide today, so I'm not sure if we will be able to find the second or the third beach but hopefully we can at least find the first one it is Merrick and Raya and Josh and myself Blaine didn't want to come with us so do we go on this trail or this trail over here Raya says that trail over here this trail is a bit slick because it's just dirt and it's like pretty steep hey there's a little waterfall down here walk out onto this little ledge how cool is that the trail is so skinny right here. We're having to squeeze through. <gasps> we just came out right here. And now we're on this trail, which we think was the other trail from the parking lot that we didn't take. So maybe we just go down here. We're not sure, we'll find it. We'll figure out where we are. It's an adventure. <gasps> I've never seen a beach this pretty before. Wow, all these boulders here. It doesn't even matter if we can't get to the second beach. This one is pretty enough. Check that out, a little waterfall. And then the creek goes out. So in order to get down onto the beach, we have to climb down all these rocks. That waterfall is so pretty. You're gonna jump across the river? All right, go. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I just wanna sit in that water. It's really hot outside. Oh my gosh. That is so cold. Never mind. I don't want to sit down in it anymore. That yeah, it's like ice. My feet are literally burning. I have to get out of it. The second beach is over here, but I'm not sure if we can get to it. That water's warm? A little bit. Hey, you're right. It's not as cold. This is not swimming oh. spot. I would be scared to swim right here. It might suck you out. There's the second beach right there. We just can't get to it right now because the tide is not low enough. Why are you being risky? I'm not gonna have you get washed away like you almost did at Thor's well. Someday it'll really happen. I feel like Josh is gonna be doomed. Merrick's hanging out on a boulder and Raya is up there playing in the sand. You cannot make that jump, don't even try. That, it'll take you away, there could be an undercurrent right there. See, see? Are you taking your shoes off? You're gonna get your feet wet. Yeah. What is going on? I wanna get past this water. Oh, it's cold. Whoa, Merrick. Holy patchouli. Uh, I think my pants just got wet. And I felt some, oh, I feel things hit my feet. It feels weird. All right, be careful. I'm scared someone's gonna get washed away by the current. Oh. Josh, what if a sneaker wave comes and washes you away? He made it. He sees the beach. <laughs> so I made it to the third beach by myself. So I came from over there. There's this secluded beach. No one else here, just me. All right, so I thought we had gotten to the final beach of this area. Wrong, totally wrong. Where I was is over that way around these rocks. But then there's a cave, pretty gnarly. I think Jinx was saying there was a cave over on that island. Just a series of connected beaches that you can only get to when there's a low tide. It's really cool, I like it here. Oh, there's another cave. What are you doing over here? I'm a big sandcastle. You're building a sandcastle. Do you like this beach? I keep hearing the sound of thunder and I'm like, is it thundering? Cause like the skies are really blue and it doesn't look like it's gonna rain at all. But then I remember just like right over here, there's a little pull off called Thunder Rock Cove. The waves sound like thunder in the caves and on the rocks and stuff. So we might have to go check that out if we can because it sounds really cool and now I wanna see it. Oh, look at this little waterfall. Oh, look, a little pool, Merrick. You want me a swimming pool? Yeah, go sit in that. What the heck? Is it cold? Not really. Oh, we'll sit down right there and splash and play. Mommy, it's not deep. <laughs> <laughs> Josh made it back wet. Merrick. Merrick is going crazy. I tried to warm up. Oh, the sand is really warm right here, huh? Yeah. 
Oh, you're gonna be all sandy. You're gonna be forced to rinse off in the cold water. One, two, three, go. Oh, he's gonna do it. <gasps> he did it. Uh, I hate to tell you this, but I think we're only on first beach. Yeah, I know we are. Well, I've seen all three. <gasps> you got to the third one? Yeah. I think you still, um, you might, I'm not sure, but you might still have a little bit of sand on your face. Oh. My feet are freezing. <laughs> <laughs> it really is like ice, like it broke, oh my God. Look how white your feet are. <laughs> you need to take your shoes off more often. <laughs> Why? I feel like they've been protecting my feet. <laughs> Look how much fun she's having. Little creek. I definitely think that this is my favorite beach in Brookings so far because it is just so pretty and there's not a lot of people here because not a lot of people know about this spot it's just a random pull off off the side of the road it's not marked there's no sign you wouldn't even know that it's a parking lot and that there's a trail here leading to this really awesome beach everyone's ready to move on what did everyone think about this beach I liked exploring the beach yeah exploring all three of the beaches oh just bragging, huh? Farewell, beautiful beach. We'll be back. I just stopped at Thunder Rock Cove to check it out because I could hear the thunder of it from where we were at the secret beach. Everyone else was really tired, so they didn't want to get out of the car. I'm not sure if this is a trail or... Um, oh, it says viewpoint 10 minutes. There's a sign. I'll walk down here and see, but I'm not sure how far I'll get. Oh, here we go. Here's a cool little viewpoint. Looks like there's a little cave in the rocks over there. It looks really neat. I'm not gonna walk any farther because I don't wanna make them wait in the car because we're, we have a long drive back home. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching. See ya.